New at 11 tonight, it was a storm that left no damage except for this one location in Sylvania. Now, this is the way our family dealt with this. A tree crashed right into their home, and it was just one of a few that fell on their property. NBC 24's Jay Hanna spoke with them during their cleanup process. Behind this wall is where Steve's Zweyer was sleeping last night when a storm rolled through here in Sylvania. This tree fell right onto his bed, bounced Steve up into the air. When he came back down, he rolled off the bed and watched the ceiling collapse onto the bed. I feel like there was an angel on my shoulder for sure. It is difficult to feel blessed when a tree falls onto your home, but the Zweyers have managed to do just that. If it had happened in the middle of the night when I was in bed sleeping, I probably wouldn't be here. If you look around North McCord Road near Peggy and Steve's Zweyers' home, there's no damage from a Monday evening storm except on their property. All season's tree care was hard at work cleaning up multiple trees uprooted from the ground. The insurance adjuster won't be in town until Thursday, so the actual damage estimate to the house is unknown at this time. Just a few years ago, the couple purchased the home with Steve's late mother's trust. So it holds a special place in his heart. His dad built it. It's almost disbelief that my father's house is virtually destroyed. I love this house so much that I, I try to work on it every day, doing something nice to it, putting in a new piece of woodwork here, there. And now I got, oh, I got such a mess. Sylvania has stepped up to help. Steve says a stranger he'd never met delivered a gift card for their dinner Tuesday night. Peggy's employer, Taylor Kia, is giving her time off to help with the house and even dropped off lunch for them. The Zweyers are now living out of a hotel room until their insurance completes its process. Peggy continues to be thankful she was at work during the storm and that the tree fell on the right part of the bed while Steve was sleeping. We are more important than the things we own. <laughs> you know, um, sorry, I'm getting a little emotional. <laughs> but, um, you know, the house can be replaced. But, you know, we're all safe. So that was, that was the best part. Reporting in Sylvania, I'm Jay Hanna, NVC 24 News. The couple is staying in a hotel at night, but they're back at the house working on cleanup during the day. If you're interested in helping out or have a service you can offer, you can stop by.